New research shows that over half of Londoners are in a worse financial position than before the pandemic. The findings come from the charity Debt Free London, who have said nearly 40% of people admit feeling anxious about their finances and struggle to talk about it. Amanda, not her real name, was one of those who ended up with serious financial problems. Here she explained what happened. Her voice has been changed to protect her identity. Well, I was fleeing from domestic violence and mental abuse from my ex-partner. I was away from home and um, that caused a lot of problem. And uh, obviously my ex-partner did everything to destroy me and that was one part um, you know, the devil occurred. And um, I'm, I'm trying just to keep it short. This is very, it still makes me very overwhelmed. Uh, going back to the situation I was in, it's very difficult. So that's for sure how it happened. Yeah, absolutely. And um, what help did you receive and um, what's happening with your case right now? Oh, well, I mean, it was really unexpected. I didn't expect that to happen. My, um, the, the, actually, it got written off and I just got the news just you know, a few weeks back. And uh, it's really hard to believe. I mean, I was really, I didn't know how to react to react after hearing the news. It was just, it was just you know, I felt a lot of uh, body was removed from my shoulder and I feel I can move on with my life. Well, let's get more on this. Matt Dronefield is from a debt-free London and is here now. Hi, Matt. Nice to see you. Um, Matt, new research has found that over 50% of people are actually financially worse off uh, after the last year. Are these uh, findings surprising? Uh, not at all. We know that over 700,000 people across the country have lost their jobs as a result of the pandemic. Uh, unfortunately, many people have quite rightly put their family's health and well-being first during the pandemic but we are really concerned that their finances have taken hit and many people will need to seek debt advice that's free and impartial and to get the support that they need. Now uh, financial issues you, you spoke there about uh, families they can actually be uh, quite a difficult thing to often talk about and um, what were some of the other findings in the research around this? So we also saw that most people really feel anxious just looking at their bank account. One in three people said that. And it was particularly for women um, that made up nearly half of our survey respondents. We also found that a quarter of people try to forget about their financial situation and just live their lives, almost kind of putting their pin in the bank, uh, you know, pin in the transaction, just crossing their fingers and hoping that it goes through. And this is a really worrying state, as you can imagine, uh, as we deal with clients every day. So it's clear that there are a, an increased number of people who, who are going to be struggling uh, financially. Um, have you in, noticed an increase in the number of people now asking for help? We have now started to see the rise. And um, last summer, we actually saw a 60% decrease in the number of people seeking our advice. But between December and March, the number of people asking for help actually rose by 164%. Um, so our message is quite clear. If you're in a financial problems, reach out and seek advice early. Our advice is always free and confidential. Uh, people can find us on our website or our free phone number. And I guess with, uh, with things like the furlough scheme still in place, uh, when that stops later this year, um, the, the numbers could increase further. What is some of the guidance um, and advice that you are offering people? So advice is always done on an individual basis and we've prepared for this by uh, recruiting and training an additional 70 advisors across London. Um, you mentioned the furlough scheme that's due to end in September. There's also the ban on evictions ending at the end of this month. Um, so I said uh, the message is really clear and simple. Our advice is always free and confidential and expert. If any of your viewers are worried about their financial situation. We know that's not an uncommon thing at all in London. One in 10 Londoners struggle and have debt they can't afford to pay back. Give us a call, reach out, and one of our team is there to help us. And um, it's worth mentioning our free phone number. It's 0800 808 5700. Matt, thank you very much. Thank you. Matt Dronefield from the charity Debt Free London there. On to some other stories.